They're jets like you see flying in front of us now. These are NASA jets and they're going to help us break the sound order. We've got to get them up in the sky first. Get them up to altitude. They've got a nice drive-by range coming up in a few moments too. After jet flies, we'll tell you the rest of that story. It's going to be very exciting to hear a couple more sonic booms. Two very different ones. Stage. The G3, let's just enjoy this. Very cool. And we're going to give you a heads up on that because as they get up into that corridor, it's going to be hard to see them. We'll see the F-15 for sure, the low vis uh, paint on the end. And then from that mark point, here comes the G3 again. It's just thrilling, it really is, and we can't wait to do this. The G3, what do you use the G3 for as it flies by? Yeah, the G3 really regard art for those shockwaves to reach us. So folks, when, when a sonic boom happens, that means an aircraft somewhere overhead is flying above you faster than the speed of sound. Now when, as the G3 comes down, Country starting yeah. by 2024. I see the con trail up there. Now that I think entering the car corridor, and we'll see if it curves down. And indeed, it is. That's the F-18 right there. You see the con trail, and it's now in inverted, right? First, now it's dropping That's down. Right. So what you're seeing now, folks, he's doing a low boom dive maneuver. He has gone inverted, that is, Ringo and Mills have gone inverted and they've done a dive, and they've since gone supersonic, so those shockwaves are now on their way to us. But because of the altitude and the angle, by the time those ones reach us, they should be much quieter than the ones from the F-15. I'm looking for the F-15, and it's probably well above us now. There it is, track, you see the white dot now. You don't see the cod trail, look for the white dot. Second mark, so they just passed through the sound barrier now. Okay, that's, that was the second one, but we got it first. Now listen for the choir. And there it was. Did you hear that, folks? From the left. I think you, folks, by applause, I think you would agree that what we see flying by us right now Number two, Paul Rosales is from Rosalind Sky Park. Number three, Olga Senikova is from Van Nuys. Number four, Dan Hall, he's from Chino. Number five, Randy Ball, he's from French Valley. And number six, Dan Hammond is at, based at Corona. They're rolling in blanks. Now yesterday I asked you if you wanted me to sweeten this with a little bit of music and all that, and you said, uh, you got it covered. You don't, you don't need that, right? Just the sounds. Oh, you did bring some music today. Outstanding. Yep, yep. So, Don Patrol taking up position. Why do they call you pickles? All right. They call me pickles because every time I go to breakfast on Saturday morning, I order a plain burger only with pickles. And All right, makes sense. Call sign pickles. They're getting ready to go now.